This LibCast will introduce you to doing a basic search in a ProQuest database. It will show you how to do a basic search and how to read your results. As an example, let's assume your professor has asked you to find information about HIV research in developing countries. The Research Library Database covers a huge range of popular academic topics on everything from politics, international topics, health, sociology, culture, and more. This database uses the ProQuest interface. Access the database from Dalhousie's list of databases. When you open the database, it will automatically bring you to the Advanced Search screen. First, let's consider our search terms. Advanced Search allows you to combine search words in a variety of ways using Boolean operators, AND, OR, and NOT. We're looking for information on HIV research done in developing countries. First, decide what main concepts you can take out of your topic, then list some terms. HIV and developing countries are the two terms that would put us on the right path. Place a star next to D-E-V-E-L-O-P so the database will know to search for any word beginning with those letters. Similarly, place a star after C-O-U-N-T-R so the database will know to search for country and countries. Use the Boolean operator AND to connect the words so the database will return results with both of these terms. In the search fields, you can enter more than one word and ProQuest will search it as a phrase in the order it appears. Enter D-E-V-E-L-O-P star C-O-U-N-T-R star in the first search field because we want the database to search for these words as a phrase. Use the Boolean operator AND and enter HIV in the second search field. You may want to limit the date range to make sure you're getting the most current results. You can also limit results so that the database will only return full text or peer-reviewed articles. If you don't select these, both types will appear in your results anyway. Besides these limiters, there are also several other ways you can limit your search, such as by author or location. For more help on building your search, you can always click on Help in the top right-hand corner. In the Help screens, you'll also find tons of other information to assist you with searching ProQuest. Click on Search to begin. The default view for results is All Sources. The tabs along the top allow you to view the results by type of publication, such as magazines or journals. The Scholarly Journals tab will bring up the peer-reviewed articles. This is important to take note of, since professors often ask for peer-reviewed articles in your bibliography. These articles have been reviewed by experts in the field. You can also organize your results by date or relevance using this drop-down list. The suggested topics box at the top is a good place to look for other search terms or helpful topics to refine your search. It's also how ProQuest makes refining broad searches easier. When you click on one of these, a new search is performed. And then you will see a list of narrow your search by options. Click next to scroll through the pages. If you click one of these, ProQuest will add this term to your search using the AND Boolean operator. In our case, since we are looking for articles about HIV research done in developing countries, let's go back to our original search results and take one of the phrases from the suggested topics to add to our search. Let's take medical research. At the bottom of the list of results, there is space for you to refine your search. In the third search field, add the suggested topic, medical research, to your search using the Boolean operator AND. Click Search. ProQuest found 139 documents with these search terms. The results are listed by title first, then the author's names, then the publication details. For more information about the article, click on the title to view the full record. You will see an abstract and the full text if it is available. There are also other details, including other helpful subject terms at the bottom. Below each record, the holdings information will be displayed. You can also access the full text here or view the article abstract. This is what the PDF of this article looks like when you click on the link. If no full text is available, you can use the Get It at Dal button to search for the item at Dalhousie. ProQuest searches many different journals, so the article you want might not necessarily be available at Dalhousie. The Get It at Dal button will let you know. For more information on the Get It at Dal service, see the LibCast that addresses this topic. You can save records that interest you as you navigate through the results by checking the box next to the result. 
As you check items, they are also put into a folder called My Research. In this tab, you can create a bibliography from all the saved results in any citation style. You can also email your results, export the results to RefWorks, and even create a web page with your saved search results. This has been a brief introduction to doing a basic search in a ProQuest database. If you need further assistance, please visit one of our reference desks, or you can get online help with our live help service. You may also want to view some of our other libcasts on doing library research, available on the displayed website.